Morning everyone, welcome to Vlogmas Day 18. I'm down in the office, it's quarter past nine in the morning. Uh, just been cleaning some cars, giving a couple out, people are still coming, um, which is good. Gonna go and film a little update video, because uh, the news keeps changing, it's changed again, so gonna film another update video. Um, I, rem I did upload one, but I've took it down because it changed that quickly. Um, and it was, I just changed it. So I've took that down. Going to do another update video with the latest news and um, then leave it a good few days. That's it for this morning for now. Going to go and do that. And then meet up with Laura. Got to go and pick up a car from the airport that's been dropped off. Probably go for a coffee and see where the day takes us. Look who's here, guys. Laura and the dog. Morning. Morning. NASA. I could find literally that's all I could find to wear. Suits your head, doesn't it? In space. Sure head. <laughs> Can I help you with something? No, just chilling. Me and me were just uh, relaxing. If you don't need a car, can you leave, please? No. So I've just done an airport run and now we have come to the cash and carry in Las Chafiras because we like to buy a big stockpile of drinks. You get much cheaper in the cash and carry. So we're going to stock up on loads of drinks. Much, much cheaper doing it this way. And then uh, get back home and unpack it all. I'll show you around. I'll show you all the drinks we get and how big the trolley is. that air freshener for you sure. get rid of your odor it's something stronger than that you got any bleach i'll put you in some bleach you know, prevent laura's coming in it's a new one never seen this one before looks like it's not fizzy might give it a go it's a whole pack of them in no sugar might give them a whirl It's been a busy little morning, loads of work going on. We did the cash and carry. So I've just come for a quick coffee and a quick ham and cheese croissant because Laura's in work soon and we haven't had a chance to eat or anything yet. It's been a manic day. It's manic in here as well. Not easy. One of them days. Now the afternoon, we've done a couple of airport runs. Laura's just gone to work, it's quarter past four. So I'm just tying up a few loose ends at the office and then I'll be heading home, walking the dog. It's a little bit cloudy, a little bit rainy today, which is a bit disappointing. Um, and then we shall see where tonight takes us. It's just a bit of a worky, worky day today. Quite a few cars going out tomorrow as well. So a bit of preparation going on. Other than that, not a bad day. Not a bad day, mate. Got to keep going. So it's now 20 past eight and I'm still down in the office working hard, emails, payments and things. I've just managed to get the Vlogmas up for today as well. So that's done. Haven't had any tea yet. Haven't walked the dog yet. Been working hard today. It's been a lot going on with the cars. So uh, working hard, everyone's still coming, all good. So, for tea, I think it's gonna have to be a takeaway pizza. I'm just gonna order a pizza and pick it up. Then I can eat, get the dog sorted, um, film with you guys, and do some other bits I need to do. So we will carry on. So, got my pizza, looks absolutely amazing. I don't get too much tomato on it because I'm not a big tomato fan. 
um, and it's just a restaurant just up the road there. I prefer to get them from a restaurant rather than like a fast pizza delivery place because restaurants need it a bit more. So nice, quick and easy pizza. I'm gonna delve in. Got me Christmas scene on in the background. Gonna enjoy, it's been a long day, but a good day, successful. Busy, busy, can't complain. So in my eagerness to eat the pizza, because it was the first thing I'd had all day, I did <clears throat> drip some grease onto my jumper. Quick little tip, if you ever do drip a bit of grease on, just grab some fairy liquid, or flota, as it's called, um, and just smear it on, and then just leave it like that, and then you throw it in the washing machine, and normally the grease just comes straight out. But just jump straight on it, get your bit of uh, fairy liquid on there, and you should be fine. Half past nine now. Woof that pizza, that was delicious. Um, so that's all done. Laura's still in work, we've both worked really hard today. What I'm gonna do now is tidy around, get the place tidy. Still got the builders in, so not worth going too mad because there's still gonna be more dust and stuff tomorrow. But I can tidy around. And I can, I'm gonna actually show you what drinks I got as well because we do stock up at the cash and carry and it does save us a lot of money doing it that way. Um, I've got my favorite drinks in there as well. So I'll just show you that before I put them all away somewhere. Aquarius here, this is made by Coke, believe it or not, but they don't have it in the UK. It's like almost like lemon cordial, but it's full of electrolytes and um, nutrients and stuff. Zero sugar, zero calories. So I really like that stuff. It's not fizzy. Mm, I can drink a whole bottle of that in like a day. It's full of um, electrolytes, as I said. We've got the caffeine-free Coke Zero. So again, no sugar, but no caffeine either, because um, I don't like being awake all night. Same with these cans, zero caffeine, Pepsi Max. And then we've got the normal Pepsi Max down there because they didn't have any more no caffeine stuff. So you'll notice no sugar. <laughs> Um, and we try and get caffeine free as well. If you're a big Coke drinker or a Pepsi drinker um, and you find yourself awake a lot or not sleeping so well, try the caffeine free because we notice a huge difference now uh, when we have the normal stuff. We notice a huge difference when we don't have the caffeine free in terms of sleeping and stuff like that. So try it. If you can get it at home, caffeine free, give it a try. Even my mum has switched now. She used to have Diet Coke. She now has the caffeine-free Diet Coke when she goes out drinking and she's sleeping a bit better at night time now. So there you go, little tip, caffeine-free. So Laura's still at work. I'm just gonna tidy up because it's a bit of a mess in here. So I'm gonna give it everything a good tidy. So I'll time-lapse that for you. You can see me clean everything. Hold up, I am on my way. I'm in motion. Let's go to the ocean. Let's go outside We can hang out on the beach without freezing Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas times We'll be chilling and having a good, good time There we go, all tidy <clears throat> Gave the place a good hoover wasn't worth going too nuts because they are going to be back making more dust tomorrow. I did spend a bit of time on the bedroom hoovering because Laura does have allergies. So I uh, wants to give it a really good hoover, get as much dust and stuff up as I can so Laura can sleep well tonight. So I've done my best there, give it a bit of a wipe over and stuff. Um, but until they're finished, we can't really go to town and, and completely smash it. So I'm going to find something to watch now. It's half past nine. I'm going to find something to watch on TV. Um, thanks very much for the tips on the candles. They are burning okay. Not mega impressed with the candle itself, but it's working. That's the main thing. I've got it back going again, thanks to your guys' tips. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time.
back from work. You were back and ready for bed. How was it? It was alright actually, quite a nice night. Yeah? Yeah, it wasn't too busy. Just heavy. Did you see I tidied up for you? Yeah, you always tidy up for me. There you go. Um, I'm craving a bit of chocolate. And we haven't opened our advent calendars for like five days. <laughs> it's how boring they are. I've not even been interested in opening them. Yeah, I know you've got a tub of roses. I just want some of these boring chocolates. It's the 17th now. 17. Can't remember the last time you opened it. Oh. I've got a 14. I've got 11. <laughs> you had five. I've got four. As you've just said, can you even tell what they are? No. What are they? What's what, that? What are they? Even the moulds are rubbish. Look at mine. What are they? I mean, that's supposed to be Santa. That's pretty shoddy. What are they? So, now Laura's home. She can do the Christmas question and answer. Yeah. So, yesterday's question was... What company made Santa's outfit red? And the answer was Coca-Cola. A lot of you got that right. There was loads of comments on that. So, a lot of you got that one right. Do we know what colour it originally was? Green and black. Yeah. There you go. Coke changed it to red. Couldn't imagine him in Coke green. Is. Couldn't imagine it. I know. It's crazy, isn't it? Right, next question. So this one's for you. Okay. In Mean Girls, oh, which yeah. Christmas song do the plastics get up on the stage to perform? I know it already. You know it already. Yeah, I know it. <laughs> <laughs> that is a little confession of mine. I do like the Mean Girls film. Yeah. You're it's really a good thinking. film. <laughs> so the question again. In the Mean Girls, which song do the plastics get up on stage to perform? Yeah, you know, the dog wants in. Oh. No. So today as well, gotta thank you all because we did hit we did hit nine thousand subscribers, which is amazing. Thank you everyone, and we also hit a million views as well um, on YouTube, which is absolutely mental in such a short time. I think we've been doing it for three three four months now so thank you to everyone i've picked out a few comments from today as well that i really liked um, i'm just going to read a couple of comments uh, from today and a big congratulations to you both over a million views in a few months keep your keep being yourselves because that is what is working for you stride with pride that was from aj thank you very much uh, we've got another one from Karen Symington, and she says, fabulous vlog guys, I've just finished an 11 hour shift in A&E in London, very hard work, and you guys make me smile every night, thank you. Thank you very much to you as well, Karen, working on the front line, lovely comment, thank you very much. And one from Audrey, Audrey comments quite a lot, love the vlogs, the opening credit credits are just so lovely and Christmassy. They always make me smile. Cheers, Andrew and Laura. I'm glad it uh, makes you smile, Audrey. Thank you very much. And the last one was from Tracy Shannon. Thank you, Andrew and Laura, for giving us the best Christmas present we could ask for. Lots of smiles from our favourite island. Loving the vlogs. Wishing you both a happy Christmas. Thank you very much, Tracy. You as well. So they were just a few of the comments I picked out from today. Loads of great support. Thank you very much to everyone who subscribed and watched or liked, commented, everything. If you do want to become a subscriber, click the button. If you've enjoyed the video, hit the thumbs up. If you haven't, hit the thumbs down and uh, drop a comment because we do love to read them. We love to see them. We do see every single one. We do read them all. And we will see you. Ah, my left arm's sore now. It's hard holding this up. Oh, actually doing some weird. We will see you for Vlogmas Day 18. Oh my God, I can't believe it's nearly Christmas tomorrow. No, this, this is Vlogmas 18, so we, it'll be Vlogmas 19. This time tomorrow, it's a week until Christmas. Christmas on Yeah, yeah, a week, week tomorrow. Yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Only so, a week left of Vlogmas. I know. What are you going to do when Goes Vlogmas quick, is over? Goes I don't know. going to miss it. I know. Might just carry on. YOLO. <laughs> 
Well, if I carry on, I've got my birthday on the 20th. You've got Boxing Day, my birthday on the 28th. New Year's Eve, New Year's Day. We can do some bits. We can do some bits. Yeah. If everyone's still enjoying them by then, they might be like fed up. Um, so thank you very much, everyone. Great little day in the end. Uh, started off negative with the, the news, but it's, it's all good. All good. And we will see you tomorrow.